Well, some San Diegans adjust to phase three of the governor's four-stage roadmap to reopening. There are some looking forward to that final phase when stadiums and concert venues can reopen. News 8's Tim Blodgett met a local inventor who hopes that his product will give more people peace of mind during a night out. Well, a big problem with opening up right now is going to a crowded place and not knowing if the person next to you is sick. But now an Ocean Beach entrepreneur says he's got the solution. From basketball games to concerts. People can't wait to get back to the events that they love. But in the age of the coronavirus, going into large crowds has put people on edge. The fear that's in public right now has a lot to do with not knowing what's the story and not knowing if um, people out there are feverish. Running a fever is a telltale sign of illness. And while many places of business are taking your temperature before you enter, what if a person develops symptoms while they're inside? The thermal reading will only work at the beginning of games, at the beginning of events when it's done. And people become feverish, say, the third or fourth inning of a game. So this will allow the people around them to monitor their, their general area. This is Richard Aguirre, an OB resident and the inventor of the temperature ticket. It's a sticker that you place on your hand to let you and everyone else know you're running a fever. So for our ticket, um, we have the center that's covered in blue, and as the, as the user gets uh, feverish, it turns to a caution, and the blue completely vanishes. Not only can the sticker tell you if you're heating up, but it can also be used as a ticket to get into events. We've also um, incorporated into the ticket a QR code so that as you're in the park, you can now go cash free. There are some kinks that need to be worked out, though. For example, the temperature outside may affect the reading on the sticker. But Aguirre says it's better to watch a game at night than not at all. But if you start to think about that versus not having games and the other impact that, it's, that uh, this virus has had on, on Major League Sports. Right now, the temperature ticket has sold a few thousand units to a few local businesses around San Diego. But Aguirre hopes that his invention will get people back into stadiums with peace of mind that they won't get sick. This tool is going to allow a lot more people to get out there and decide if the people that they're surrounded by, they feel safe being around. Tim Blodgett, News 8. That kind of reminds me of the concept behind mood rings that were a real thing in the 70s, but they did react to the temperature of your body and change color. I don't know if you remember that. I do remember those. I may have had one or two over time. And, uh, you know, it, oh, there, I want pictures. There, there's a lot of room for innovation out there, and people will be taking long, hard looks at these options because people, they want to get back to some semblance of normal. If that's going to allow us to do things like have large concerts and things like that, once again, I'm sure most people will be more than happy to wear one. Yeah, a, a small hurdle if that works.